Hey everybody, my name is Tara and today let's talk about fast food and diabetes. That sounds like a surreal combo, right? But I'm here to tell you that fast food can actually be safe for people with diabetes. Today I'll give you five tips on making the right food choices when you hit a fast food restaurant. Let's get started. Okay, so there is probably no need to say that when you have diabetes, you need to follow a healthy diet to manage your blood sugar levels. And you're well aware of the impact junk food can have on them. A meal from a fast food restaurant can pack loads of calories, sodium, fat, and carbs, making fast food harmful for a person with diabetes. But with a little bit of knowledge, people with diabetes can eat fast food once in a while without putting their health at risk. So let's see what tips I have for you. Tip number one, swap fast food for healthier alternatives. When ordering fast food, you might have the choice to swap fatty fried foods for healthier options. So always ask the staff if they offer such options. Now, what kind of healthier options should you switch to? Let's dig into that a bit deeper. Option number one, switching from fried to grilled food. For example, try switching to a grilled chicken sandwich instead of ordering a fried chicken sandwich. Also go with lean meat such as chicken, turkey, or fish. Option number two, swapping the bun with whole grain bread or using lettuce as the bun. Option number three, going with the healthy toppings. Avoid cheese, bacon, or mayonnaise. Instead, choose guacamole, avocado, or extra leafy greens. Option number four, swapping the sides. Choose side salads, fruits, and vegetables instead of french fries when available. For example, a small fruit cup contains 100 to 150 calories and almost half the carbs compared to a small pack of french fries. Now tip number two, pick places with healthy menu options. Today, many fast food restaurants have calorie counts on their menus and nutrition information on their websites. So it's always a good idea to check the menu options and plan your meals beforehand. If you don't see such an option, just ask if the specific fast food place has friendly options for people with diabetes or healthy alternatives in general. Also this way, you'll learn what fast food restaurants are a go-to and which might be a big no-no. Number three, downsize your meal. Okay, I know that ordering a supersized meal is always a huge temptation since fast food restaurants offer them at a really good price. Don't fall for that. You may save money, but this way you'll consume much more calories, sugar, fat, sodium, and carbs. When ordering, go for a small size and choose the side in the beverage yourself. For example, if you're used to eating double cheeseburgers, order a single patty burger with the salad on the side and plain water for a drink. Remember, when people are served more food, they eat more, even if they don't really want to. Tip number four, rethink your drink. It's easy to drink hundreds of calories without realizing it. I know that it doesn't sound like the most appealing option, but I strongly recommend ordering water instead of soda. When you swap sugary beverages for water, you avoid all these unnecessary calories and blood sugar spikes, as well as reduce the feeling of hunger more effectively. Tip number five, don't go if you are overly hungry. When you are really hungry, you're more likely to make unhealthy food choices and of course, overeat. Always try to have a healthy snack, such as fruits or vegetables before hitting the fast food place. This way, you'll also have extra time to plan your order. All right, so you can always use these tips while making decisions at fast food restaurants, but I strongly recommend talking to your healthcare team that knows your condition and can suggest the best food options. Now watch the next video about how to read food labels without being tricked and the following one about hidden sugars. See you next time.